Hello, welcome to Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host, Jerry Hansen. Today we're going to talk about eggs. Let's go collect some eggs. Now, when you're collecting eggs, you want to make sure that you inspect them and make sure there's no uh, a lot of not a lot of soil on them. Like these have a little bit of uh, mud because they get mud on their feet. And what you want to do is take them into the house, and you do not want to draw uh, wash them off with water. Uh, you want to dry wash these. The reason being is because uh, you know, just take a little, a little bit of a, um, a, a rough cloth and kind of buff that stuff right off of there. If it needs to be washed, then you'll want to use the same temperature of water as the egg is. Because what happens is when um, the, a chicken lays the egg, the egg, uh, the final coating on the egg is when it first fresh laid, it's kind of wet. And until that dries, that wetness is called the bloom, and that bloom is an antibacterial coating on the egg. Now the egg shell is porous, and that egg, uh, that bloom coating keeps bacteria from entering into the egg shell. Inside of the egg shell, there's this membrane that protects the yolk and the albumin, the white part of the egg. Now. Um, when you uh, add cold water to the egg, when you when you try to wash the egg with cold water, it causes that membrane inside the egg to shrink and pull away from the shell, and it, it in essence it washes the bloom off and it pulls any bacteria that is on that surface, it pulls it right into the egg and causes a a, a bacteria infection inside the egg. So that's what you want to avoid. Now when you're storing your eggs, most your eggs have a small end here and a big end up here. You want to store them in this position in your egg carton. Now as far as the, uh, the uh, data goes that I gleaned off the internet and off of Google, uh, I found that the eggs are good 45 day, for 45 days refrigerated after they're laid and uh, the documentation also says they uh, have a shelf life of uh, 30 days after processing. Now as a home uh, farmer, uh, here in my state our governor signed a farm bill that protects small farmers. So, uh, but the eggs there's a few things that are uh, still uh, governed uh, that has to be uh, carefully monitored. So, but as far as the eggs go, the requirement for the small a hobby farmer, if you want, to, if I want to sell my eggs, uh, I have to, uh, I have to provide certain uh, information on the egg carton. Now this egg carton is a used egg carton. It comes from another uh, manufacturer uh, or egg producer. And so what we have to do in this case is we have to tear, uh, tear or deface the old label off and provide our own label uh, instead. Now a couple of the requirements for egg uh, labeling for the home farmer in our state is they require you to put a safe handling instructions right here and uh, you want to they also require you put the the grade of your eggs and I believe this is uh, grade A, grade double A. Grade is referring to the overall uh, parameter of weight of a carton of eggs of a dozen eggs. Uh, that's what I've gleaned from it. You also want to have your your name and address or your address on your label so if something happens they could trace that egg back to your uh, hands. You you can uh, deal with uh, me medic medicating the treatment of the eggs and this way it protects the public. So when you're selling food products you, you want to be conscious of the fact that there's a possibility that your eggs can get tainted, and if you sell a tainted egg, 
you are ultimately responsible and held liable because if you make somebody sick with your tainted eggs, you're the one responsible. And so this way they can uh, trace it back to you and also keep that egg uh, that egg product off the market and keep from other people getting sick and possibly killing people because botulism is one of those diseases that can be created in eggs and you really want to be careful keep your environment clean keep your eggs clean and be careful when you're selling your eggs this carton of eggs is ready for market I just put it in the refrigerator put my use by date on there and we're done well that's it on eggs here at Pine Meadows Hobby Farm Please subscribe, click on the like, and leave a comment if you'd like. It really helps me out here at Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host, Jerry Hansen, and please come again. Mm -hmm.